Welcome to the ca- Oh. Hey. There you are. I'd begun to think you skipped town without telling us. <laughs> yeah, finals. I know, they're a dreaded time. Were they pretty hard this time around? <laughs> yeah, that does sound hard. I always wonder why professors make the last week so important. If you've shown up the whole semester and done the work, shouldn't the last test be easy? Exactly. <laughs> Alright, well, what can I get you for today? Wait, let me guess. Hmm, a small half-sweet mocha and a blueberry muffin. Lemon? <laughs> wow, it's been a long time. Even your taste has changed. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm just teasing you. What? Oh, yeah. We are slow today. I think it's all the rain. People don't tend to come out when it's pouring outside. Yeah. We've been doing well overall, though. Ever since we opened last year. It's like the community has really welcomed us. I'm sure I'll still see my regulars today. Like you. <laughs> Who's a regular? Well, if I know your order by heart. <laughs> I did not get your order wrong. You changed it on me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Of course. Blame the barista. It's not like it's my job to serve you or anything. <laughs> hey, are you alright, though? No, it's just... You look a little tired. Yes, I should hurry up on that mocha, huh? All right, let me just ring you up. It'll be four dollars and twenty cents. <laughs> that is the price. Yes, it is. Call it a favorite customer discount. Or maybe a finals freebie. All I did was knock off the muffin. Stop arguing and just swipe your card. Or I'll make the whole order free. Whoa. Hey. Are you okay? You just got dizzy? Okay. Um, here. Let me get you a stool and you can sit for a bit. No, no. Seriously. We don't have any customers today. Even if we did, I wouldn't just leave you like this. <sighs> oh my god. Are you okay? Shit. Shit. Come on. Wake up. Okay. Well, they're breathing, so that's a good sign. Maybe some cold water will help. Should I just 
dab it on their forehead? Are they overheated? Oh, oh, hey, you're awake. Are you all right? You, you just passed out. No, no. Hey, stay down. I mean it. I don't know much when it comes to first aid, but I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to stand up for a while after you pass out. You did, yeah. The cloth? Oh, um, I thought you might be overheated or something. I was hoping it would cool you down. <laughs> you have some nerve laughing at me. I didn't know what to do. I've never had anyone pass out on me before. Do you think you could eat something? <laughs> what do you mean, of course not? I don't know. Then, some sort of sugar should do you well, right? Hold on. Let me get some candy from behind the counter. Here. And here's some water, too. No, it's okay. You shouldn't have to move anywhere. Not right now. Anyway, there's nothing wrong with being on the floor. You shouldn't be worried about appearing proper. Not right now, anyway. <sighs> Who's gonna watch, huh? The CCTV? <laughs> I'll just sit beside you, right here. Take as long as you need. You look a little better now. Are you feeling it? Yeah, you've got color in your cheeks again. You went really pale for a moment there. Are you still dizzy? A bit? Okay. Then, let's keep you here for a little longer. What? Why are you saying sorry? You didn't do anything wrong. It's not like you came in today and went, Huh, I think I'll scare the shit out of this barista. Of course I care. You collapsed in front of me, and I haven't seen you for a few weeks. Were finals really that rough? Have you been sleeping? <sighs> no, of course not. Why would you need more than two days of sleep in a week? I know. I know that essays are hard and finals are getting to you. But five all-nighters? Really? Ugh. Enough of that. I don't want to lecture you after you've just fainted. Right now, I would rather see you better. Look, I can close the shop for a little while. We're slow today, anyway. And Chong Yun's gonna clock in in about an hour. I'll just say I took an extended break. I'll walk you home, alright? I don't want you out in the rain alone. If something happens again, you need someone with you, all right? Thank you. 
I just need to take off my apron and lock up. Then we can head out. Which way do you live? That way? Okay. You don't have to thank me, you know. I really meant what I said. I'm happy to help. And I'm especially happy to help you. What do I mean? Just, you're a good customer. Yeah, and I'd hate to lose you. What? I am not a terrible liar. I didn't even lie. You are a good customer. And? And... You're a cool person, too. One that, well, I wouldn't mind knowing a little better outside of work. You'd like that? Really? You don't have to say that just because I'm walking you home. I promise. You mean it? Well, today you're tired, but when you're a bit better rested, I would love to get dinner with you. I can pick you up, maybe? Now that I know where you live. So... Tomorrow, um, 8 p.m.? Yeah? Great. Oh, and take it easy the rest of today, okay? What happened to your mocha? No, I'm not gonna give it to you. I didn't bring it out. How can you even ask for that? You need to cut the caffeine. Seriously. Look, I can take you out on as many coffee dates as you want. But all of that has to wait until you're better. Alright? Coffee advice from a barista is as good as a doctor's advice for a patient. So, no buts. <laughs> I promise, the next time I make coffee for you, I'll make sure the foam art blows your mind. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow, then. Take care. <laughs>